Welcome to Tokyo Saurus. So, what's up in Japan? The moment you've all been waiting for is finally here. ReZero is finally getting an OVA. Not a sequel just yet, but getting an OVA is better than getting nothing at all. We will be getting into some spoilers territory here, so if you want to be completely surprised by this OVA, or if you haven't watched the original ReZero, you have been warned. So, a two minute trailer was released by Kadokawa for this new OVA. And in it, Subaru looks very distressed about something and basically snaps and says he can't deal with it anymore. Amelia thinks it has to do with his curse, but turns out it really doesn't. And we flash forward to a kitchen scene with Subaru hard at work along with Rem and Rem. Amelia asks what they are making and Rem answers with three letters, OVA. As you can clearly tell from this trailer, this OVA will be animated by the same people who made the original ReZero, which also means that everyone from the original cast is also returning, so no need to worry about that. So what is this mysterious OVA going to be about? Some people thought this OVA was going to be the what if chapters that that billionaire guy from Twitter wanted to fund a few months back. Yeah, so this is definitely not that. Most of the clues are pointing to this OVA to be an adaptation of the mayonnaise chapters. So basically, the mayonnaise chapters happen between arcs 2 and 3, which is about episode 10 or 11 in the anime. And nothing really plot changing happens in them. Sort of like a filler chapter, but still canon in the web novel. Now some of you right now are probably like, What web novel? I thought ReZero was based on a light novel. So the web novel and the light novels are written by the same author. The web novels are free to read online, while the light novels are out there on sale at actual bookstores. The light novels are polished versions of the web novels, removing unnecessary parts with the same plot, and just generally a better experience as some would argue for the reader. So back to this mayonnaise chapter. It starts with Rem, Ram, and Subaru in the kitchen, and they're preparing to make mayonnaise under Subaru's directions. Apparently Subaru's parents were mayonnaise fanatics, and especially the dad, which is why Subaru is sort of knowledgeable in how to make mayo from scratch in the first place. But his memory is kind of hazy and they proceed to make it anyways. In the process, they ended up actually making it, and Rem becomes much closer with Subaru. Which explains how Rem warmed up so much to Subaru between episodes 10 and 11 of the anime, to the point Rem is completely attached to Subaru. This chapter was pretty popular, so it was also adapted into the manga. So seeing it being adapted into an OVA is not too much of a surprise. Especially since this will be focusing on Rem, who is way more best girl than Amelia. What better way to satisfy your fans? So does any of this point towards an anime sequel to ReZero? Unfortunately, not at this point, we have absolutely nothing from White Fox or Kadokawa pointing towards an eventual sequel to the original ReZero. But seeing how they're pumping an OVA exactly around a year after the last episode of the anime, it seems like they're trying to keep the fanbase interested and seeing how the light novel and web novels are still going strong. Although it's looking like they still don't have enough material right now at this very moment, by the next time around the same year, they should be in a much better place if they decide to make an anime sequel. And to be honest, with a series with this much hype online and in Japan, they're definitely going to make a sequel. It's just a question of when. If you guys want to check out the actual trailer, I have it linked in the description below. So what do you guys think of the upcoming ReZero OVA? As usual, let me know down in the comments below. Thumbs up the video if you liked it, and don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications for Tokyosaurus for the latest things people are talking about in Japan. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.